I do hope you're holding up well. My name is Karen Kibat. I'll now take uh, take it away with the sports news making headlines and the WRC headlines. Now, to start us off, the government is planning to extend the World Rally Championship WRC Safari Rally from a three-day sporting event. President William Ruto directed the Ministry of Sports to work with the International Automobile Federation, FIA, and the WRC to make, to actualize the plan. This while flagging off this year's WRC Safari Rally at KICC Nairobi. Two, one, and off they go. Starting the, the president said that the government is is provided by the WRC Safari Rally to drive economic growth. He said the extensive worldwide media coverage for the rally enhances Kenya's global image. The president said that the rally is scheduled for the Easter holidays to encourage more Kenyans and visitors from around the world to participate in the event. Media coverage of our country's attractive attention generated by WRC provides a definite and major boost to our economy, boosting incomes for boosting direct and indirect jobs, attracting local and foreign investment in tourism, catering and accommodation infrastructure facilities and services, thereby injecting into our economy. President Ruto urged Kenyans to come out in large numbers and make this year's safari rally experience. Sports Cabinet Secretary Ababu Namwamba said the government will work with the WRC to continuously improve the Safari Rally into a world-class sport. The rollout of the Talanta Motorsport Academy will nurture future Kenyan motorsport talent. And we are looking forward to witnessing this academy become the breeding ground of the next big rallying star ecosystem. We are making a big transition in terms of improving the management of the World Rally Championship Safari Rally project, and we can assure our people get better. A total of 28 cars have lagged off and headed to 2.84 kilometer super special stage where Thierry Norville took a slender 0.1 second lead over his Hyundai team. After winning the opening stage. Over the last few corners now. Done for Thierry Neuville. Yeah, I, don't beat, I don't know if he beats Hannah. Reigning world champion, Kali Rovan. The top three, just 0 0.7 seconds farther back. Kenya's five-time Safari Rally winner, Carl Flash Tundo, was placed 16th, 23.0 seconds adrift, while Kali 17th. Massive amounts of water, and I think we're going to see a lot more of that as the uh, as the weekend progresses, looking at Karen Patel in the Skoda there. The competition now heads to Naivari. Is beginning Friday with drivers taking on the looped 121 kilometer long Loldia, Yotamol, and Kidong stages. The drivers at the end of the rally on Sunday, a total of 367.67 kilometer distance of competition. Banadokumu Prime Edition.